I've come to realize that each place has meaning to different individual, essentially. <laughs> A lot of my work is focused on buildings and urban sketching, urban landscape, particularly places with authentic feel to them. There's something about a building weathering, you know, basically surviving the weather <laughs> that gives it some character and qualities to it. My name is Colin White. I'm an illustrator and artist based out of Ottawa. I've been doing this for over 10 years. I did a series of corner stores, kind of local community stores, about 12 or 13 years ago that uh, sort of resonated with people, especially people in the neighborhood. When Bushies was closing on Elgin Street, it was a sort of a corner store, a grocery store, neighborhood store, you know, you could get all sorts of things there. It was family run, it had been around for decades. Cool sign, cool looking store, like right in the neighborhood. So I went and sketched it and I met a woman. She basically kind of came down to pay tribute that day because when she was growing up on Sundays, her father, they would maybe going to church. After they would go to Bushy's and they would get pastries there. And it was like this ritual for like her and her family growing up. Hearing something like that made me appreciate like, so, you know, I'm making this drawing that is in the moment right now. But for her, that drawing might evoke, you know, her childhood. I'm here at the uh, Ottawa Civic Hospital campus. This uh, building is turning 100 years old in 2024. So I've been invited to do a sketch and some artwork to commemorate the 100th anniversary of this building. It's the first time I've done something for a hospital or medical uh, facility. Just the size of it is a challenge. It's a large building. It's not a two-story house. <laughs> It's very detailed as well, again, talking about the craftsmanship and the architectural detailing that uh, happened in older buildings, essentially. Like, there's certainly a lot of that going on. Sort of ornate sculpture at the top of the building. There's a crest in the middle. I do sort of recognize the serpents going up around the staff on the sides. Above where the Ottawa Civic Hospital, the words are engraved and there's some weather and kind of this turquoisey fading that's happening in some places and not happening in other places. So, you know, I do appreciate that type of stuff. You know, it's very interesting that the Civic Hospital was built in response to the flu pandemic 100 years ago. And here we are, coming out of another pandemic, now paying tribute to this building. So the printing takes about five minutes to do each print. It feels good to see the first print for sure. It's certainly a privilege to be working on it and to be capturing a building of historical significance for the city and to be helping preserve that in its own way and helping transition to another era of the Ottawa Hospital. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs>